Well, people that are getting really excited for the upcoming sequel to Venom, which I presume will be called Venom 2, or possibly Venom Maximum Carnage, because they can capitalize on all that nostalgia. Good news about the second villain in the film, who of course was revealed to be Shriek, because now we have an actress in the lead. And some outlets are even saying that she's already been cast, so let's talk about that. So in case somehow you missed the news, yes, Venom will be fighting off against two people in the upcoming sequel. He will be going up against Carnage, but also the villain known as Shriek. Now again, like I've said in other previous videos, when I don't know something about a character, I'll come out here and admit it to you guys. This particular character I know very little about. It's not a character I've gone out of my way to really look into or really ever fall in love with like I have with many other characters. I've seen her in the, you know, issues with other characters and that's really it. So I could be off on some details, but to my knowledge, she has some sort of power that has to do with sound? Sound manipulation maybe? Kind of like Black Canary, I could be off on that. Like something with sonic fields or something. Anyway, she can like shield herself in it, which obviously if you know symbiotes, you know why she's a perfect adversary considering they're very susceptible susceptible i messed up on that one they're very susceptible to sound so this gives her a perfect opportunity to be able to take on multiple symbiotes now also according to some people she's going to be teaming up with carnage so we'll see how that goes you know we don't really know the full details but right now naomi harris is the one that's currently in the front running and some are willing to say has been cast in this role. Now, Naomi Harris has been in uh, quite a lot of big roles that a lot of people might know, um, just to give you a really big one of one of my favorites that she was in. Uh, 28 Days Later. That's an old one, kids. That That is really old. You should look it up. It's a really good zombie movie. But anyways, um, I think she's a good pick. Now, I've seen some people argue about the whole um, skin color thing, and I'm just like, look, Shriek in the comics is like pale white like whatever and it's like nothing to her story really gives her the you know like having to matter with color or anything like that it's not like you know they're just forcing it on there they're just looking for the best actress that they can get for the role and again this reminds me of the whole thing that happened with domino when he cast Zazie Bates, everybody was like, oh, up in arms first. And I was like, oh, no, wait, she was really good because she's really talented. And she was one of the standouts of Deadpool 2. So that's really how I'm feeling about this. Honestly, I'm excited to see what Naomi Harris has to offer. Because, again, very talented actress. And um, this would be another big get for Andy Serkis's second follow-up to Venom. First follow-up to Venom. Venom 2. It's the second film. It's the follow-up to the... Never mind, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> 